and the soaring success from both Toledo Rocket teams, because again, they did very well when men's and women's basketball teams had more fans actually gearing up to show their support. So our Trent Croce actually visited a local store to see who's been taking in all the merch. Now, Trent, who's doing it? What's going on? Give me the deets. Well, Tatiana, the Buckeye store and more in Sylvania is mostly known for the OSU Michigan fans. But if you look closely, they do have a space set aside for those loyal Rocket fans, too. And the workers say the team's clenching those wins and having successful seasons, for the most part, means wins for their business, too. It's no surprise inside the Buckeye store and more to see a lot of scarlet and gray and a little maize and blue. But salesman Scott Heberger says one area getting some attention features gold and midnight blue. It always helps business when the team's winning, and uh, yeah, Toledoans like their Rockets, so every time they win, they'll come in. Heberger says fans have been coming in throughout the week to gear up up until the ball tip-off. Some even came in before heading out to Cleveland for the men's championship game. They wanted to have their nice attire before they went to the game, but always before the game, they like to come in and get a new shirt. Not only is Greg Haas a store employee, He's also a rocket. It's definitely increased since March is here now. So, you know, March Madness and the tournaments. And this morning we had a bunch of people coming in. When it comes to the sports and their seasons, Hebiger says locals seem to have a preference. Oh, I think Toledo's a more of a football town. But we've got a pretty good fan, fan base with basketball. But uh, football always seems like it does better here in Toledo. But there's no surprise Haas supports the Rockets himself no matter the season. You'd love to see your college team do good. Football season was, you know, not the best, but, and then basketball, we're in the finals. As the time goes on, we'll have more apparel in stock uh, going into the spring and summer season. And while tonight the men's season was cut short after their loss to Kent State in the MAC Finals, the Rocket women will find out who they will play in the first round of the NCAA tournament tomorrow during the selection show. Our team will be following. Reporting in studio, Trent Croce, WTOL 11.